admittedly, when switch rods came out to begin with, it, it was a really, really good idea. There was one big, big problem, and that was there wasn't very good lines for them. So what a switch rod is, if you think about, this is very similar to almost what your nine foot five weight would be as far as the taper of the rod. It's a little softer in the tip, and then it gets stiffer through the butt. And so it allows you to actually make not only a spay cast, but an overhead cast. And what you'll find in, in switch rods is, is that when you're designing a rod, you really have to lean one way or the other. You either make it more kind of a spay taper, if you will, that'll allow it to kind of hold the, the loop or the, the tension on the rod, or you make it more overhead taper so you can actually pick up a line and aerialize it and cast it. So most switch rods tend to lean more towards kind of this switch taper, a little softer in the tip, more power down here. 